welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing day and an amazing new year. So today's video is a really exciting one because I'm going to be doing my updated makeup collection. I am so excited to do this because I got tons of requests to do it when I asked you guys what videos you wanted to see. I have a lot more makeup than I did have back when I filmed this video in like 2017. Also, before we get into the video, I just wanted to say that I'm going to be attending Playlist Live Orlando 2020. I am so excited to meet you guys and I am just excited to go. So if you guys are attending Playlist live you guys should attend my meet and greet it's gonna be with around like 20 other creators some tiktok creators youtubers and just video creators overall make sure to follow my instagram it'll be on the screen and in the description down below if you guys want to attend because i'll be posting all the updates on there so i think we should get right into my makeup collections so let's do it on top of my makeup drawers i have this really cute little like little dog plate thing that i've had for a long time i have this candle from marshall's home goods it smells really good and this cute little snow globe and here are all my makeup brushes i'm just gonna tell you where a couple of them are from i have these two from morphe they're really nice powder brushes um i have a bunch from this Too faced set that i got for christmas Here's some powder brushes from e.l.f. I have a couple of Real Techniques brushes because Real Techniques brushes are really good and they're pretty inexpensive. And then I have some Morphe eyeshadow brushes. All the orange ones are from Real Techniques. And then I have a couple from like Target and stuff. I also keep them in this really cute little container that spins. And I just love it. It looks so pretty and like professional. And I got it from Marshalls. So here are my Ikea drawers. I've been using these for a few years now and they're really, really good for storing my makeup. So here is my first drawer. This is where I store the majority of my makeup. So these are some Laneige lip masks. I really like these. So this one is strawberry, candy, and mint chocolate chip flavored. It's really, really good. It comes with a little applicator, which is super nice. I just have a little section for those because I really like to use those a lot. And next to it, I have all my highlighters. So let me just zoom in for you. So here's my little cube of highlighters. I don't have that much highlighter, but I really want some more highlighters just because highlighters are one of my favorite makeup products so this is my all-time favorite it's the ColourPop highlighter in the shade flexitarian it's really really good and I totally recommend it and I also have a Becca highlighter this one is in champagne pop it's so pretty and I have a wet n wild highlighter if you guys are gonna get a drugstore highlighter totally recommend this one it's so inexpensive and it's really pretty and then I have a sample of this Benefit cream highlighter. To go along with highlighters, I have this adorable Too Faced highlighter palette. And it's like Neapolitan colors. It's so adorable. And I got it for Christmas. Over here, I have all my blushes. So if you guys have been following me for a while, you would know that blushes are one of my favorite makeup products to use. I just feel like blush cheeks are such a cute look. So I have two Tarte blushes. This one is called Party. And this one is a full size. And it's called Blushing Bride. I have this Milk. Milk Makeup Cream Blush, which is one of my favorite blushes. It's so gorgeous because I really like cream products. And then I have this Glossier Cloud Paint. I really want to get more Glossier makeup. So if you guys want to see like a Glossier makeup video, let me know because I'll totally order some more. I have a NARS blush and a Too Faced blush. I'm just going to move this out of the way for a second. So back here are my lip glosses that I use the most or like my lip products that I use the most. So I have this one from Bath & Body Works. I have this NYX lip liner, which is a really good lip liner. And I have two of my favorite lip glosses, or actually three of my favorite lip glosses. This one's from Petite & Pretty. This one's a gorgeous one from Marc Jacobs, which I recently got. It's my favorite. I'm actually wearing it today. And then this one from Rimmel. It's really nice and really inexpensive. And then I have a Sephora lipstick. So I have a ton of more lip products I will get to after. But those are just my favorite ones. And then back here, I have some powders and bronzers. So I have the Hoola bronzer bronzer, a Maybelline bronzer, a Rimmel Stay Matte powder, and a Milani bronzer. It's kind of hard to see because of the glare. And then just a sample of a Benefit cream contour. I'm not so much into contour because I'm just not that good at makeup. In the back over here, I have like my eye products and then I have like concealer foundation. So I have this Laura Mercier tinted moisturizer, a Maybelline instant age rewind, which is my concealer that I use every day, an eyeshadow primer from Urban Decay, and a mini professional primer and then over here I have my mascaras and my brow products guys if you haven't used Glossier's mascara you guys need to try it out it is the best mascara ever it's not clumpy and I wear it every time I wear mascara basically and then I have the benefit roller lash I have a mini Too Faced one and 
obviously the Glossier Boy Brow. I think that's what it's called. Yeah, it's called Boy Brow. And then I have this eyeliner. I never wear eyeliner, so that kind of just came with a palette that I got. And then back here, I have two beauty blenders. So I'm not big into beauty blenders, but I do have these two because I used to use them a lot, but now I'm kind of just into using my hands and my fingers, obviously once I wash my hands and stuff. But I feel like it just blends better, and yeah. So that was everything in this top drawer. I try to keep it as organized as possible. This is probably the neatest you'll ever see it. Down here, I have all of my eyeshadow palettes. This is the mother load of my makeup collection because I just have so many eyeshadow palettes and I don't know why. I am obsessed with Jeffree Star's makeup. It is just so amazing. So I love this Jawbreaker palette because it's so pretty. Like, look at these colors and the quality is amazing. Um, I have a Conspiracy palette. Um, I did a makeup tutorial on this. You guys should totally go check that out after this. This palette's amazing. It's kind of hard to use the colors because they're a little bit out there. This is probably the palette I use the most because it's very neutral. It's the Morphe 35O. These colors are just perfect for an everyday look. I'm not gonna go through every single one in depth, but I have two Too Faced palettes. Really love these. I have a Too Faced Life's a Festival palette. Um, I have a Maybelline The Nudes palette, a Naked 3 palette, another Too Faced, this Petite and Pretty 9021 Glow, which they sent me. And a mini Too Faced eyeshadow palette, which I've had forever, but it's still amazing for like traveling and stuff since it's really small. Then back here, I don't know if you guys could see, but I have a ton of boxes because I'm one of those people who saves boxes for makeup if they're cute and like nice quality boxes. So yeah, I don't think you guys care about boxes. So I have no idea how I organized this. So I'm literally just going to, I don't know how I organized it, but that's basically that. So down here, we're getting more into like skincare and some other stuff. So I do have my two favorite foundations. See, these are the Giorgio Armani foundations. They're a fortune, but if you guys have tried them, let me know if you like it because it's my favorite. And I don't wear foundation that much, but I do love those. I have some face washes over here. Not sure if you guys care, but I have some acne free products that they sent me and I have a Cetaphil oil skin thing. Um, I have some acne medication and stuff. I don't have acne, but I do get pimples a lot. I have some moisturizers. So I have this Fresh Rose Deep Hydration and this Drunk Elephant one, which is really nice. The Drunk Elephant one's actually a sample from Sephora. This is a sample from Sephora as well. It's like a belief eye cream and I have this Tarte one. I have this really old Bobbi Brown thing, which I really should throw away because I've had it for like two years. Um, this is what I used when I had a sunburn on my face and I needed a good moisturizer. And over here we have the rest of my lip products. I'm not going through every single one because that would just take forever. I'm gonna show you guys a couple of my faves down here. So I have my Lime Crime, which is really pretty. It's a liquid lipstick. I'm not into liquid lipsticks, but this one's definitely a good one. Um, I have some like cute stamped eyeliners a company sent me. Some more lip glosses from Bath & Body Works and I have a MAC lipstick. Kind of just some random ones that I don't reach for as much, but I still own them. I love these face masks so much. They're from Glam Glow. They're called the Bubble Sheet Face Masks, and I got a bunch of them for Christmas. And same with these Biore, I don't know how to say it. Nose strips, love those. I have the Signature Mario Badescu Facial Spray. I don't use that as much because I'm not into like spraying my face as much, but if I do, I will reach for that. And then I have three Victoria's Secret Pink Perfume. I also have the box for the conspiracy palette back here. I don't know if you guys could see that, but I kept the packaging because I don't know why I'm a hoarder. So that's basically everything in this drawer. Down here, I keep my contacts. This isn't like very makeup related, but I do have some more palettes. Um, these are from Alter Ego. They sent me a ton of their eyeshadow palettes, which I'm so thankful for. And I just didn't have room up here for them. So I just put them down here. So I have the Sephora palette, Aurora, the Goddess palette and the Daydream palette. This one's probably my favorite, to be honest, because it's super cute. I have some like traveling makeup bags. I have a ton of these. I don't know why, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna use this one for my brushes when I go to Playlist Live, because it's just so adorable. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below so that I know that you enjoyed the video. I'm trying to do more content that like you guys enjoy. Um, I'm trying to take feedback from you guys, so definitely let me know. Follow me on Instagram, and I love you guys so much. I'll see you in my next video. Peace.